school's back in full spring. Pa uh, parents, I'm sure you're uh, thinking about putting together after school snacks for upcoming holidays, maybe birthday parties. Well, here to tell us some fun and healthy, that is the keyword idea in behind this whole entire thing, UW registered dietitian, Taya Bach. And you have got quite the Halloween, speaking of holidays, Halloween themed tray here. Tell us all about this. You can kind of, hopefully we'll get a sure. shot of this. You can tell. Yeah, so I meant one of the things when we're thinking about snacks for parties or upcoming school events is, you know, providing something that's kind of healthy, not as processed, not as full of sugar, but also that's fun, appealing, you know, visually um, pleasing. And this is what this guy is here. He's my vegetable <laughs> skeleton. Um, it's kind of a mini version of what you could make. Um, and so, you know, it could be kind of fun. You could say, oh, hey, I'm going to eat his elbow or uh -huh. whatever. And then his head here is hummus dip. Um, and you could use lots of different types of dip, ranch dressing, yogurt, um, salsa, whatever. And a lot of those things come in indiv individualized containers. Mm -hmm. So, like, if you're at school, a child could have their own container. Um, and it's just kind of fun. It is. It is. And, you know, you, kids, kids absolutely love this. And they, you know for lack of better words, eat it up because they really do. They'll like be like, oh, you know, oh, I want a pair of his ribs yeah. or something like that, and they'll go after it. And, of course, uh, it seems pretty simple to put together. I mean, maybe getting the entire shape, but as far as the ingredients are concerned, seems yeah. pretty easy. And, and that's one of those things you just want to kind of keep it simple. Um, you know, if you're the parent that wants something a little bit you know, more extravagant mm -hmm. or you want to make something, um, you know, you got to remember that you're the cook in the kitchen, so you yeah. can modify the fat and the oil or sugar um, using applesauce, um, Instead of oil, you can do a one-to-one -one ratio or yeah. use whole grains, things like that, um, just to, to kind of um, provide a healthy treat. Now, real quick, I, I know some kids obviously do not like vegetables, so we have something here as well, granola yeah. bar. It has some chocolate chips in it, but still healthy. Yeah, and so this is pretty easy. It was seven ingredients. Um, you didn't have to bake it, mm -hmm. and it's, you know, it's not a candy bar, but it's, it's sure. still fun and different, and that's um, kind of what makes that appealing to kids. So again, just a little bit of, uh, you know, elbow grease and you can have some healthy meals for your kids without having to resort to those, you know, pizza pockets or whatever yeah. else you give them after school. True. Yeah. All right. Thank you so much. There you have it. Stick around. Brian will have a final check on that forecast right after the break.